Hi everyone, you're welcome to Mom Health Parenting YouTube channel. I'm Dr. Ogbebo of Mom Health Limited. Today we'll be talking about how to care for your baby's cord. When I mean cord, I mean the umbilical cord. This cord is what is a tube-like structure that connects the mother to the baby. It takes food and oxygen from the mother to the baby and takes waste product from the baby to the mother's body so the mother can excrete it. This cord is clamped and cut and that's what we have as the storm that remains on the baby's belly after birth. At, after birth, the storm usually shining and yellowish in color. As time goes on, the storm begins to turn brownish or gray, at times to purple, blue, then finally to black before it finally falls off. Um, it takes about 10 to 14 days roughly for it, the cord to fall off. Uh, at times it can take as long as 21 days, so you don't need to panic if it does not fall off after two weeks. The shape the belly button takes afterwards is not dependent on how the doctor cuts it. Well, it, it you can only know the shape it, it will take after the storm falls off, be it the any type or the outy type. So how do you care for the storm? For the storm, brother. Um, the uh, WHO recommendation, the World Health Organization recommends that, used to recommend that alcohol-based products should be used to clean the storm. Um, that's in, we, a lot of people used to use spirit. But then it was found out that this alcohol-based product used to kill the bacteria, the normal bacteria that should um, care for the child that should protect the child usually kills it so it's the new recommendation now is for you to just keep the storm dry and neat and uh, without applying anything that that's the new recommendation if you must apply anything the application application of anything is for people that gave birth to um, unsafe environments, be it in, in villages or without any professional around. But if you give birth to your child in the hospital or at home with health professionals available, you don't need to apply anything. I've heard gist of people applying cow dog or urine on their baby's storm and all sorts. You are going to expose your child to infections like tetanus, which might actually kill the child. So chloroxidine cream is the only thing that is recommended by the WHO for you to apply on the child's storm if you gave it to the child at, in an unsafe environment. And for those mothers and grandmas especially that must apply something on the child's storm, please just apply chloroxidine cream and nothing more. No eats, don't apply any form of eats on the child's storm too. It can expose the child to infection. Then you can just, um, when taking the child's bath, try taking sponge bath. That way you can always avoid um, making the storm very wet. You can then uh, make sure the um, diaper is always folded in front so that it does not cover the storm and a breeze would not get there. So make sure the storm is well exposed and um, it is usually dry. Also, resist the temptation to pull off the the storm, let it fall on its own. It's going to fall at the right time, so you don't need to pull off, pull it off. Then um, after the storm falls off, what would you see? Basically, most of the time you can see few drops of blood on the baby's diaper, in front of the diaper. You don't need to panic, you don't need to worry, it is normal. But by the time the storm falls off and you see blood oozing out of the storm, of the, um, yeah, of the navel, Please rush the child to the hospital. That is not normal. Then if you see your child uh, running fever unnecessarily or you notice the child is having abdominal pain or tenderness, maybe when you touch the baby's abdomen, the child starts crying or the child is convulsing or the child is crying excessively. If you notice any of this, please take the child to the hospital. And if you notice any form of discharge coming out of the abdomen or of this uh, navel after the storm falls off, please take the child to the hospital. And um, if you notice, even if the child, if the, now, the storm does not fall off at three weeks, don't worry about it. Make sure the, child, the um, storm is not being covered by the diaper and if can take up to six weeks at times after six weeks please if it is not falling off take the child to the hospital thank you very much please 
don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and don't forget to share this video also hit the notification button to get more videos like this you can also visit our website at www.momhealth.com.ng for all maternal and baby products guess what we have a 10 percent discount for you for all purchases made on that website another good news we have for you is you can also visit google play store and download the mom health mobile app to explore all our amazing features thank you very much